Hey everybody, it's Rachel Old Beauty and today I'm here to talk to you about my favorite foundations for women of color. If you want to see what I love, please stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like what you see, thumbs up please. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. One of the questions that I get a lot in my inbox and on Instagram and Facebook is women want to know what foundations do I recommend for women of color. This video is going to help you go into the store and shop with confidence and look for those brands that are not overlooking us and have a wide range of colors for all skin tones. So first of all we're going to start high end. Um, these are the department store brands. They are a little bit more expensive but I'm going to tell you why I like each one of them. So the first one is going to be Fashion Fair. Fashion Fair um, sent me products maybe a few months ago. This particular product is called the Refining Minerals Foundation. And to be honest with you guys, I was really surprised at how much I liked it because like many of you, you know, maybe you bought Fashion Fair, Fashion Fair many years ago and then somewhere along the way you started checking out other brands and you kind of just started overlooking them ironically but they actually do have a wide range of foundations they've always had a really wide spectrum of colors for women of color and so now they have um, as well as a wide spectrum of colors they have a wide spectrum of, of formulas as well so this one I guess I'll go ahead and put this on so you guys can see it the texture is really creamy but it's still lightweight and that's one of the reasons why I like it because you can see it's giving me coverage but it's a very natural finish and if there's anything that I know about women of color is that we want to look natural we don't necessarily want to look like you know we have a lot of heavy makeup on so I use this color a lot in the summertime it worked well for me the finish was lightweight but it still gave me coverage and I really liked it and they, they have also a lot of other um textures as well so definitely go check out your fashion fair as they would say it's not your grandma's found it's not your grandma's uh makeup anymore so go check out fashion fair also at the department store is makeup forever the hd foundation this is one of my favorite foundations you all have seen me use this one a lot too they have a wide range of of colors and uh, formulas as well from creams to concealers but this one here I really like it's great if you're taking photos if you're going to be on camera and you just want a really flawless finish definitely check out Makeup Forever I think you can get it at Sephora and, and Ultra Ulta where's my brain today this is MAC now I know a lot of you guys are loving MAC and I love MAC too I actually used to work for them um, this is actually one of their concealers. I'm going to go ahead and put a, a little bit on because I told you guys I want to do this quickly. But this concealer, I really like it. A lot of times when I do a concealer, I'm looking for something that's creamy. This one I found has covered really well to be a liquid formula. So I was kind of, well, I guess I shouldn't really be surprised because most times MAC get it right. Um, now this doesn't have, does this have a name on it? Oh, this is the mineralized concealer. So most days I don't really wear a lot of foundation unless I'm like taking photos or it's a special occasion or something like that. For the most part, I will just dab a little bit of concealer around my eyes and then just a small amount of foundation only in the areas that I need it because I really like for my skin to shine through. Now let's go to the drugstore. If you haven't already, check out Shea Moisture. I'm actually going to do a giveaway with them in a few weeks and I'll be talking more about how to cover your blemishes with their foundations and concealers. This one is called, it's just called the Sheer Foundation. They also have a lot of colors for women of color. Um, this one says that it minimizes the appearance of the signs of aging while hydrating the skin. So of course, if you want a really youthful and refreshed look, check out Shea Moisture. Um, it is a long wearing foundation. It's a really nice dewy finish. I already have a video on, on this. So if you want to see more of what this color looks like, check out the video. And then last but not least, the CoverGirl Queen Collection. Um, 
Sam Fine is the one who turned me on to this brand. I have a lot of stuff from cut from this collection. I have bronzers, eyeshadows, like they really did not get it wrong. And if you're someone that's shopping on a budget and you really don't want to spend a whole lot of money for a foundation, I would check out the CoverGirl Queen or the Shea Moisture. This one is available at Target and this one is available at Walmart, Walgreens, CVS, a lot of different stores have this. And I want to say it's maybe around $10 or $15. So these are my favorite foundations for women of color. I forgot one. Let me add this one. That's, of course, the Bobbi Brown. I used to work for Bobbi Brown also. And this one is my one of my favorites to wear like in the winter or the fall. This particular forma, formula because it's very oily. Um, well, I shouldn't say oily because anytime you say oily, people get scared. Hydrating. Um, but when you put it on, you're going to feel like you're giving your skin a drink of water because it's really, it's packed with antioxidants. It has an SPF of 25 it smells really good however it's $65 so <laughs> I probably should have talked about this one first because it's the most expensive out of all of the ones that I recommended but if you're in Macy's or online Bobbi Brown as well she gets it right when it comes to women of color so thank you all for watching this video I'll be back soon and if you guys have any more requests or questions you can always comment on this video or hit me up on Instagram and Twitter thank you so much for watching take care Thanks for watching. Meet up with me in October for the Flawless Fall Meetup. Visit my website to get more details.